Absolutely, let's dive into the world of Palantir Technologies, exploring its recent performance, market dynamics, and potential future catalysts. Palantir Technologies, often referred to simply as Palantir, has been a subject of considerable attention and speculation in recent market discussions. As we assess its trajectory, it's crucial to acknowledge the dynamic nature of the market and the myriad factors influencing Palantir's stock movement. In our recent market escapades, Palantir has exhibited a blend of volatility and resilience, mirroring the broader market sentiment. Like a true roller coaster ride, Palantir's journey has seen moments of pullback followed by spirited rallies, leaving investors on the edge of their seats. A pivotal event in Palantir's recent narrative was the release of the PCE, Personal Consumption Expenditures, Index, providing key insights into the inflationary environment for April. This data point held significant sway over market sentiments, especially concerning the probability of interest rate adjustments. The index's alignment with analyst predictions brought a sigh of relief to investors, signaling stability in the inflationary landscape and potentially influencing future monetary policy decisions. Against this backdrop, Palantir's performance remains a subject of intrigue. Consolidating within the trading range, Palantir experienced a modest decline of around 2% during the session, with intraday highs exhibiting resistance around the $22 mark. Volume metrics, a vital gauge of investor interest, hovered around the 44 million mark, reflecting sustained market attention. Delving deeper into market dynamics, the looming specter of the S&P 500 quarterly announcement on June 7 adds an extra layer of anticipation. Speculation runs rife regarding Palantir's potential inclusion in this prestigious index, with proponents arguing for its candidacy based on various merits. While inclusion is by no means guaranteed, the prospect alone has the potential to galvanize investor interest, potentially serving as a catalyst for Palantir's stock. Furthermore, Palantir's recent strides in securing lucrative contracts, notably its partnership with the U.S. Army valued at $480 million, underscore its growing relevance in critical sectors. With substantial upfront payments and ongoing collaborations, Palantir is poised to capitalize on its expanding footprint, further bolstering investor confidence. Navigating through the ebbs and flows of the market, Palantir's resilience is underscored by its ability to weather storms and capitalize on opportunities. As discussions swirl around its potential inclusion in the S&P 500 and its strategic partnerships, Palantir remains firmly entrenched in the spotlight, beckoning investors to decipher its next move. In conclusion, Palantir Technologies stands at a pivotal juncture, poised to capitalize on evolving market dynamics and emerging opportunities. As investors brace for the next chapter in Palantir's journey, the only certainty amidst the uncertainty is the unwavering intrigue surrounding this enigmatic entity. On June 21, a significant event looms large for Palantir stock, PLTR, investors, the rebalance. But what's capturing the attention right now is the upcoming announcement on June 7 regarding the board review. This pivotal date, a mere week away, is likely to be a catalyst for increased chatter and speculation surrounding Palantir's trajectory. As discussions percolate, it's crucial to factor in Palantir's increasingly favorable position. The company appears primed to meet the stringent criteria for inclusion in the prestigious S&P 500 index. To secure a spot in this elite group, a firm typically requires four consecutive quarters of gap profitability. Impressively, Palantir boasts six quarters under its belt, surpassing the benchmark with ease. For a detailed breakdown of the S&P 500 criteria, refer to the recent video analysis. Amidst this backdrop, investors are grappling with a crucial question, is now the opportune moment to buy the dip in Palantir? The stock currently hovers in the low 20s, seemingly finding support at this level. Recent developments, such as the establishment of a significant AI contract worth $480 million, underscore a promising trajectory for Palantir. Indeed, a clear pathway toward maturity and valuation growth seems to be emerging. Critics may point to Palantir's premium valuation as a deterrent. However, it's essential to contextualize this within the broader AI landscape. With the AI sector experiencing a boom, Palantir's valuation appears more reasonable in comparison to its peers. Moreover, recent market trends, coupled with encouraging data such as the healthy PCE index figures, fuel optimism regarding Palantir's potential resurgence. The current juncture presents a compelling case for a Palantir comeback. With six consecutive quarters of gap profitability and record earnings, the company's fundamentals remain robust.
the recent correction, exacerbated by adjustments in guidance, may have triggered overselling. However, Palantir's transparent communication regarding future expectations instills confidence. Looking ahead, the impending S&P 500 announcement on June 7 could serve as a catalyst for a significant market reaction. Historically, inclusion in the index has resulted in notable increases in market value, ranging from 5% to 27%. This surge can be attributed to the influx of investment from index tracking funds, highlighting the significance of this milestone for Palantir. Shifting focus momentarily to NVIDIA, another key player in the tech sphere, discussions surrounding the impending stock split abound. Scheduled for June 7, this move aims to enhance affordability and accessibility for investors. With the stock split set at a ratio of 10 for 1, NVIDIA shares will become more attainable, potentially stimulating increased options activity. In conclusion, as investors speculate on Palantir's short-term trajectory and the looming S&P 500 announcement, it's imperative to maintain a balanced perspective. Considerations regarding market trends, fundamental strengths, and upcoming events should inform investment decisions. So, what's your take on Palantir's prospects? Share your thoughts, and let's navigate this dynamic market landscape together. Until next time, take care, enjoy your weekend, and remember to disconnect from the market frenzy occasionally to savor life's simpler pleasures. ChatGPT. Let's delve into the fascinating world of Palantir, the enigmatic stock that has been fluctuating between the price range of $21 to $23 in recent times. There seems to be a conundrum surrounding Palantir's business model, particularly its involvement with government agencies, making it a perplexing investment choice for many. The intricate nature of their operations, especially in the realm of governmental contracts, has left investors grappling with understanding the true essence of Palantir's value proposition. Upon closer examination, it becomes apparent that deciphering Palantir's activities within the governmental sphere is akin to navigating through a labyrinth of secrecy and complexity. This opacity has led some investors, including myself, to reassess the viability of Palantir as a long-term investment option. After all, investing in a company whose core functions remain shrouded in ambiguity is akin to venturing into uncharted territory. However, amidst this fog of uncertainty, there are glimmers of clarity that shed light on Palantir's potential trajectory. Take, for instance, the recent revelation of a $480 million contract secured by Palantir. This significant milestone not only underscores Palantir's growing prominence but also hints at the evolving landscape of governmental spending priorities, particularly in the realm of technology and artificial intelligence, AI. The implications of such a contract extend beyond mere financial gain for Palantir. It signifies a shift towards a future where software, particularly AI-driven solutions, plays a pivotal role in military applications. Palantir's transition from a software company to a prime contractor for high-profile hardware programs exemplifies the transformative power of technology in modern warfare. Consider Project Maven, the latest feather in Palantir's cap. This initiative, aimed at enhancing target identification processes within the military, epitomizes the convergence of AI and defense technologies. By leveraging AI algorithms to sift through vast swathes of data, Palantir empowers military personnel to make informed decisions swiftly and accurately, thereby revolutionizing traditional warfare tactics. The ramifications of such advancements are profound, signaling a paradigm shift in military operations from human-centric to AI-driven decision-making processes. As drones replace manned aircraft, and autonomous vehicles redefine ground warfare, the role of technology in modernizing the military cannot be overstated. From an investment standpoint, Palantir's strategic positioning within this burgeoning landscape bodes well for its future prospects. The anticipated surge in governmental spending on AI and related technologies is poised to fuel Palantir's growth trajectory in the coming years. As antiquated equipment is phased out in favor of AI-enabled solutions, the demand for Palantir's expertise is bound to soar, translating into lucrative opportunities for investors. In essence, while Palantir's operations may appear opaque at first glance, a closer inspection reveals a company poised at the forefront of technological innovation in defense and government sectors. As the world embraces the era of AI-driven warfare, Palantir stands as a beacon of progress, offering investors a tantalizing glimpse into the future of military technology. Here's an expanded version, delving deeper into the emotional journey and qualitative analysis of Palantir's stock. Investing in Palantir is not merely a financial decision, 
it's an emotional journey for many. Consider those who were early investors, buying in at less than $10 per share, now watching as it has surged to a staggering high of $27.50 just two months ago. It prompts reflection, did they miss out? Did they seize the opportunity? The uncertainty looms large. None of us foresaw this meteoric rise, reminiscent of other success stories like Carvana, which saw its shares plummet to $4 before soaring to new heights. Indeed, the stock market operates as both a weighing machine and a voting machine. In the short term, it's driven by sentiment and perception, often subject to wild fluctuations. Palantir, despite facing its share of challenges, is currently riding high on a wave of investor enthusiasm. But perception can shift in an instant, leaving investors wondering when the tide will turn. Navigating these emotional currents is crucial for investors. It's about anchoring decisions in fundamentals while resisting the pull of emotions. Mastery of this delicate balance is the key to success in the markets. That's where our community comes in, a supportive network equipped with tools to help you weather the storm of emotions and emerge as a more resilient investor. However, even amid the euphoria, there are qualms about Palantir's practices. Some aspects of their financial reporting raise eyebrows, with tactics seemingly aimed at manipulating earnings per share figures rather than focusing on sustainable cash flow. Such maneuvers may raise concerns about the company's long-term health and transparency. Then there's the matter of leadership. Alex Karp, Palantir's CEO, commands attention not only for his strategic vision but also for his controversial statements and actions. While superficial, his unconventional demeanor raises questions about his stewardship of the company. Does his penchant for confrontation serve shareholders' interests, or does it distract from the core mission of building a stronger business? Indeed, the CEO's behavior is under scrutiny, with remarks about burning short sellers raising eyebrows. Such rhetoric, while provocative, may ultimately undermine shareholder trust and detract from Palantir's credibility as a long-term investment. In assessing Palantir's worth, we must turn to the numbers. Revenue projections paint a picture of robust growth potential, with varying scenarios reflecting different levels of ambition. Profit margins and free cash flow estimates further inform our analysis, allowing us to gauge the company's intrinsic value. Yet, even with these calculations in hand, the question remains, what is Palantir truly worth to investors? Despite its promising prospects, doubts persist, doubts about its leadership, its financial practices, and its ability to weather the inevitable storms of the market. So, as Palantir's stock continues its dizzying ascent, we're left to ponder its true worth and our place in its journey. Is it a fleeting opportunity, a bubble destined to burst, or a diamond in the rough waiting to be unearthed? Only time will tell. But one thing is certain, in the ever-changing landscape of the stock market, emotional resilience and a steadfast commitment to fundamentals will always be our guiding stars. Palantir, a tech company, has witnessed a meteoric rise in its stock value over the past year, prompting widespread speculation, especially on platforms like YouTube and Twitter, that it could become the next big thing akin to Nvidia, potentially reaching $500 per share. While such enthusiasm is palpable, it's essential to anchor investment decisions in fundamentals rather than emotions. Let's delve into Palantir's performance and prospects. Firstly, the staggering numbers, a one-year return of 168% and a year-to-date increase of 35%. However, it's crucial to recall instances like Tesla's trajectory, once considered unstoppable but now experiencing volatility. Palantir's stock hit an all-time high of $45 per share on January 27, 2021, only to tumble thereafter. Such roller coaster rides underscore the importance of cautious optimism and vigilant evaluation. A retrospective glance reveals moments of exuberance, with some influencers hyping Palantir's potential skyward journey, only for it to plummet. This underscores the risk of following trends without grounding decisions in solid analysis. Amidst such fervor, it's vital to discern between trading based on momentum and investing based on fundamentals. At Everything Money, our ethos revolves around instilling a deep understanding of the underlying principles of investing. Every asset carries a price, determined by myriad assumptions. The greater fool theory, wherein investors bank on selling to someone willing to pay more, underscores the speculative nature of certain investments. While Palantir boasts impressive profit margins and groundbreaking data analytics capabilities, prudent investors recognize that every investment boils down to the present value of future cash flows. Buying at the peak entails accepting the associated risks and potential losses. 
However, the focus should remain on comprehending the fundamentals that drive sustained growth.